Find yourself a nice flat area, place the skis on the snow, hip width apart and parallel. Make sure the toe bindings are lined up together. One foot in the middle and we're ready to put the skis on. Now bear in mind at this stage, depending on the snow, you might find you have snow stuck to the bottom of your boot. You can either give it a tap with a ski stick, a scrape, place the toe under nice and straight, look behind, make sure it's lined up and give a good solid push. You're in. So you've got the skis on. Now, just spend a few minutes on the flat before you even start sliding, just getting used to the feeling of them. Don't have to lift them up, just slide them forward one by one. Maybe walk backwards and forwards a few times just to get used to it. So it's now time to actually ski down the hill, but before we do that, we've got to get up there. There's no point in facing up the mountain and trying to walk the way you want to go. You'll simply just slide backwards and look like Michael Jackson doing the moonwalk. What we want to do, get our skis sideways and across the hill and then just gently using your knees and ankles, roll the skis onto their edges and start to step up. We've made it to the top of the slope. It's now time just to simply slide down. Use your poles for a bit of balance. Step round, feet hip width apart, skis parallel. Very important, head up and look where you're going. Anybody who's ever taught a child to ride a bike knows the problems. As soon as they look down, they're gonna lose balance and fall over. So check the slope and just gently start to slide. A Couple of pushes with the poles and just stand as normally as you can. Okay, perfect. Now I've chosen this slope, so I've naturally come to a standstill. Look for a slope with a flat part at the bottom or even a slight uphill, so you're not gonna panic about feeling like a runaway train. Avoid sticking the poles in to try and come to a standstill. Literally, stand still on the skis, let them get on with it. If you're doing this without your poles, it doesn't make any difference. Just relax and let the slope naturally slow you down and come to a stop. 